Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to check a website or page creation date. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, let's open up a web browser, and if you wanted to navigate to a specific website or a specific page within that website and wanted to know when it was first published, I'll show you some tricks to do that. Let's open up Google here and we're just going to type in, let's say, ESPN.com and go to ESPN.com. If we're wondering when ESPN was first created, I can use this specific URL and use a really cool archive machine. It's called the archive.org. Uh, so, Go to archive.org. It is the Wayback Machine or also known as the Internet Archive. The nice thing is this tracks every single website or almost every single website on the Internet and scans it over time. So you can enter in a URL. So let's type in ESPN.com and hit go. And you'll be able to see here a calendar of all of the times that it has been scanned. And I can go back in time to 1997. It looks like that is the first time that it has been scanned. And the creation date was December the 11th, 1997. That is the very first time that ESPN.com was scanned by the web archive. Now, keep in mind, this might not be exactly accurate because maybe it existed for a few days or weeks before this basically found it and scanned it. You can, of course, just go into the source code or the HTML of a specific page. And sometimes on there, there is a created date or a creation date, especially for articles or news or anything like that. It will show you when it was published, the exact date and the exact time. But if you wanted to just go back and find something that doesn't have that, this is a great option to see when it was first scanned. And of course, the cool thing is you can go back and see exactly what it looked like when it was first published. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. And I'll catch you on the next one.